and waffles. Chicken and waffles! We gotta learn how to do this. Hey guys, so as you can see, we have some vegetable oil already heating up on the stove to prepare for the fried chicken. Yes, I'm super excited. Um, we are gonna use chicken breast for this recipe. This one is boneless. What he's doing right now is actually cutting off the pieces of fat because we don't want that fat back. That's not good for you. So he's gonna cut those off and then we're gonna slice these up to make nice tenders. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, now that we have most of the fat cut off of this chicken breast, we're gonna slice it up. Yes, look how well those cuts are. Oh my God. Now, this is important, guys. Once you are done slicing up your chicken, you wanna make sure that nothing else touches this knife or the cutting board, and you wanna make sure you clean your hands so you don't cause cross-contamination. I'm so excited. So for this recipe, we're only going to use two uh, large chicken breasts that are boneless. Uh, once these are cut, then you'll see actually him to rinse the meat because we want to make sure that we get all those extra bacteria off of the chicken. This is always important with your poultry. Poultry is the main meat that we need to make sure that we're always constantly rinsing because it can hold bacteria and make you sick. We don't want we don't want you to make you sick. We want you to enjoy your food. <laughs> I know I want to enjoy my food. So, if you want to practice safety tips and tricks, make sure you always rinse off your poultry. That goes for chicken, turkey, any type of bird. Black pepper to taste. So we have our all-purpose flour in a separate bowl. My favorite part, shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> I love it. All right, so we're gonna be using um, and your mama's or pearl milling company buttermilk. So to make the actual waffle batter, I love this uh, pancake mix, guys. All you have to do in order to make waffle batter is add water and a little drop of oil. The perfect waffle. So while he's mixing, we're gonna use olive oil as our oil for the waffle batter. Look how perfect that batter came out. Awesome, just a drop. All right, our oil is hot and it is time to drop in our chicken tenders. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's ready. I'm super excited. All 
All right, guys. So while the waffle urn is making our waffles, we're gonna take a look at some of the chicken and see how the first batch actually came out. Yay. Let's get a close up on that. Right? Oh my gosh, delicious. <laughs> All right, time for the second batch of chicken. Woo -woo. It smells immaculate in here, guys. Oh my gosh. Please, if you haven't already, make sure you like this video and make sure you share it with your friends. Don't forget to hit that bell icon to make sure that you're notified whenever we make any new recipes. Now, while we're waiting for more chicken to cook, let's take a look at these that have already cooked. Ooh. Oh my God, they are so tender. Look at the smoke. Mm, 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 mm. Chicken and waffle, waffles for breakfast at home. So if you haven't already, make sure that you also follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and on my TikTok page. That's right. Sometimes I post some shorts of my TikTok videos. Would love to follow you back so we can make sure that we stay connected with you. All right, the waffles are finally done. As we see, the green indicator light is on. So let's take a look. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I don't even know what to expect, but I know they're gonna be delicious. All right, guys, now if you have a waffle urn yourself, just make sure that you be very careful. And I mean very careful because it is super hot. Um, you want to make sure that you don't burn your fingers and also you don't want to break up those beautiful waffles. Look at them. They are amazing. All right, now it's time to plate. Thank you so much for watching. We really do appreciate you. And we also welcome all of our new subscribers. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, share it with your friends, and turn that bell icon on so you could get notified when we post new delicious recipes. Welcome to the Nash House and welcome home.